Hello my fellow gamers and welcome back to our Clan Rictus campaign, campaign for the North, where um, it's all seemed to have gone slightly wrong. Um, Malekith was pushed off from his dark hidden base here and suddenly just pushed forward. Um, so we just scattered and grabbed more bases. Um, over here we got humans just generally getting in the way. There is generally no reason why they're there. Um, so that's a problem. We also have Marathi here, and the army we had here was destroyed, and we're quickly, desperately trying to build up a new army. But we pretty much have no money. Uh, yeah, so it's all going well. Ah, but we do have this guy. Most masterful of masters. Seriously, you're not going to let me pick that up. Fine, we'll go elsewhere then. All sea powers. Won't let me pick it up, so yeah, you can just say that. Right, uh, to be honest, I think that's pretty much it for this turn. It was just, yeah, we're quickly trying to reinforce. Quickly trying to build what armies we can and get them into action as soon as possible. Because these are the two main armies of the Dark Elves. If we can beat them, or even just run around them, we're good. In theory. I could be wrong. It won't be the first time. <laughs> All I want to do is get comfy at my desk and I'll destroy that. <laughs> What's good as well is in the last episode, the lizard men declared war on the dark elves, so now they've got something to worry about. Can just auto reserve that. Yeah, they're just going around sacking it all. It's fine if they want to do that, go for it. Well, pff, nothing I can do, and it's not worth the investment chasing after them. Oh, here we go. But this and my this men commune, your lord finds a hidden door to the side of one of the pyramid temples. Inside is a brilliant sheet of metal carved with strange symbols. Your lord tries to sass it away, but today, as the item has already caught your ever watchful eye, confiscate it, copy the symbols, or set it. Um, so what's this then? Don't want to lower leadership. Oh, research rate might be good. All we can get. Treasury and bonus experience. Hmm. Actually, what about we need money? There you go. So, where's Malekith gone? Malekith's going. I said that. It looks like he's gone. Stretched, craven tail. Oh, fantastic. He's left Hargreef completely undefended. All hail Hornet Rat. I believe. Both armies can get there. So do we try and grab that? Because that's why they're big cities. While I'm at it, if he's going for Negron... Quick, grab that. Don't disappoint me. Oh, we're waiting for reinforcements, but... Tempted to cancel that. And move them into there. Is that a walled settlement? It is. You know what? We'll do that. We'll get rid of that. Look at him, Hob. He's having such a good time. Then you can recruit some more. You know what? Maybe I should just focus on spears. Being he hasn't got any. How about you? Surely you're near full strength. Yeah, you're practically there. So, you can go around here. Most masterful of masters. I order Sky yeah, move. so we can grab that settlement off from soon. So, this is the thing. Do I... Well, I've already grabbed that one, but I could send him to grab that settlement. Or we grab that. Hmm... Dark 
You've nearly finished recruiting completely, which is good. That's good. Um, how are you doing? Uh, better in battle. Physical resistance, nice. Yeah, so do we try and grab this while we can? Or do we just ignore it and go for these two C's? Questions, questions. I mean, we got Marafi there to worry about. Hmm, decisions, decisions. Could have finished. We could take that this turn. Uh, they've got a lot of like Black Guard. I think they've got Black Guard Crusades, both of us, you know. Yeah, they've got a lot of elite stuff. But we will be sending in two whole armies of Skaven. It would cost a lot of Skaven lives, but we could take. I mean, look how much money it's getting them. 1500 how much is that getting them 600 41 yeah so if we get that it's also a massive financial gain Let the bear scream, scream. right let's call me lord craven tame the, the council's voice the council is, is disappointed Move them in. Alright, okay. So you guys are nearly finished. Fantastic. You're accruing. You're nearly going there. I reckon it would be worth it. Which army do we send in? Now. I'm trying to think which army would be better. Because let's not forget this guy can forward deploy. So we can actually deploy close to the wall. So I think he'd be the best one to send in. Yes, it means they'll take the most casualties. But these guys are coming as reserves. Um, yeah, if we could have a couple. To battle, I come after. Um, yeah, I think we're good to go. Let's battle go for fight. it. I mean, there's five units of Black Guard, which is a bit concerning. Four units of Black Guard, Crusades of Hambos, Dark Shards, couple of Harpies. To be fair, that's the main core there. But if we can beat this army, if we can take the city off them, we would I'll do very well. <laughs> I'll lead from rear. Yes, you will. This could be such a big battle as well that it takes up the whole episode, but it'd be worth it. So we're going to have the front army run in, because they can obviously deploy quite quickly, get in there, um, and then the Plague Monk army will come behind. And just, yeah, try and run in. It just makes sense. Tread can actually get in there a lot quicker. More worried about everything else. Well, the Black Guard are going to be an absolute nightmare. Because obviously they've got anti large as well. So the Rat Ogres, they'll just rip up. I think the objective for the first wave should purely be capture the walls, break the gate. Um, and the time we've done that, the second wave should be able to just swarm through it. I mean, it's a small settlement, but yeah, there's the reserve. So it's got to take them time to get there. First of all, let's get the Rat Ogres straight there. They're going to break the gate. Uh, right, let's just get everything into order. Do the North Clan Rats, slaves, the Gutter Runners. 
Scaven slaves with slings. Corbett is. Storm vermin. Storm vermin there. We then have obviously our two characters. I think we should focus on this side. I say that, if we focus on this side, we can disable the towers by the time the reinforcements come in. So if we focus our biggest strength here, okay, so we've got the rat ogres, gutter runners we'll have on this side. Hmm. The clan rats are sealed, so I've got to call them up that wall. Now, you guys, I've got to follow the ogres in. We then have the scaven slaves at the front, which is going to probably take the bulk of the hitch. What have we got here? Yeah, they're all just clan rats, slaves, that sort of thing. So I think I'll just pay them along here. And let them just do their thing. Right. Get all the orders done. Oh, I need to do... That we want you to go there. You can go well there slingers. I get both slingers to go for black guards and then what we're gonna do is just grab all of you, start from there and just go go. Done. Okay, that was painful. Ow. Yes, good, yes. By council, yes. Oh good god, the rat ogres have been smashed. Right, what they're doing with them. Why you just stood there? Get up there. All of you. Hang on, did they not? Did the gate open so the rat ogres could run through and then closed again? I have questions. Right, they're all getting out. And what's good is this part of the wall's empty. So we'll be able to swarm through. Harpies have jumped on there. Got our main force going on up here. Yeah. Um, let's do that on the web. Guys, I need you to get in there as quickly as you can. Magic's ready. 
Where is the majority of that? Yeah, they're mostly there. Hang on, we've got rat ogres in the back line. Get down if they're not that bothered. Right, let's get. I was hoping the doors would be open, but since they're not, I say that. How long have they got? Oh, they got a little while to go yet. Um, guys, climb up there. You, yeah, up there. Hang on, plague priest. Oh, okay, great shit, plague. Okay. So they're moving up. Um, you guys do have. Is that storm vermin it does? Yeah, it is fantastic. That's the sort of reinforcement you need right there. Oh, have they broken through now? Everybody in, in, in. If you haven't been given the orders to get in, you're now getting them. There you go, and while they take that... You guys... Actually, play catapult. I want you to flee. Dreads, craven tail. Looks like we've got a mass rap going. And to be fair, can you blame them? The oh, awesome. I can just summon more ratchet. Look at them coming in. It's just like, nope. We don't care. Let's just drop a river on them. There you go, more clan rats coming in. Just absolutely overwhelming them at this point. exactly what's going to happen. You are going to die here and it will be glorious. Come on guys, get in there. Do your part. There you go. 
massive death frenzy on that boom. And poison as well. Yeah, that's just gonna break up. There we go. Done. I think we lost a lot of rats though. But that was like one of their main buildings left there, one of their main cities. How did we lose? 474, that was the front wave. And then 349. Not bad, not bad. Of course, not sure what's going to happen. Malik finds out we've grabbed this behind him. But they, I believe they've only got two armies, and that's Marathi and Malekith. Yes, yes, victory for Tretch. That is a big victory, though. We'll retrieve it from your cause to top of Clan Pictus. To be these guys the didn't lose that many. Scream, scream. I say, say, move. Right. What fancy things we got here? Oh, uh, warpstone weapon, yeah. Grab that and uh internet. Yeah, we'll do that. too strong. Um the deep what would oh we can't get it, yeah, okay then. What encourages growth? That's you know what we could just do that. We'll grab that for that one. I think that was worth it because now we've just taken a huge chunk of their income out of the system. And this army should easily be able to deal with that. He says. I kind of want him to come and attack us because then, yeah. We got a lot of troops here. Mighty am I, I. Uh, can I afford some games? Game slaves, that'll do. All hail, rat. Yeah. So, yeah, that works, that is. I think we can end the turn there. But that was a big victory for us. Oh, he's attacking that settlement, which makes sense. He can have it. No? Oh, he didn't want it. Okay. He sacked it. Interesting choice. They're raiding. Let them. We'll deal with them soon enough, because it's a very basic Empire army there. Right, you're pretty much a full strength, so I'm gonna take you out. I'll get help. What? Can yes, yes. There we go. So now they'll get a full strength, and you guys can go in and really benefit from that. Generally, couldn't care about that. We do have. Ota of Ultimate Darkness. Apparently they would destroy us. Could be because half of it's slaves. <laughs> they fetch many water, okay. To be fair, we can just sit there. Get the things. We don't have to worry. We can just let them kind of die out on their own. Nagoron, how are you for defence? It's not great, but I think after that turn we will be able to. Where's our hero? Ah, okay, yep. Yeah. Where is it? I think they've gone, kind of gone too far for me to get them now. Right. What? Oh, that's their big... I say their big settlement. There's not much there. 
And it'd be interesting to try and lure this army out. Don't disappoint me, me. Wait, doesn't this provide plague pre I say that I don't really have the money. Address me as Right, well, what I want to do is can is there any reinforcements coming? I don't think so because the Tomb Kings have. In fact, something's going on over there. I think the Tomb Kings are taking that. I think the Dark Elves might be on a timer. What we will do is move you. Actually, should we go for the Circle of Destruction? I think Don't we will. Me. Oh, Monolith can be upgraded, but... Mm, yeah, right, we'll do that. Because I forgot that when you upgrade them, they do give you more food. I'll do that the way. I've taken nearly all of the north. I've yet to see any buildings that up food. And yet the plague ones in the southlands get one in their starting city. It seems a bit, eh? Yeah. You can stay there for now. Never know. They might get tempted to go up there because we're actually oh, attack now. And if they do, that's great. That's just an army of slaves, and these guys can come in. In fact, we couldn't even maybe get behind him. But we will have to see. I am not bothering to repair that. Oh, yeah. You're just continuing siege. Actually, I say that. Yeah, just go over that. And turn. Um, yeah, I think we can end the turn. I mean, I was tempted by that because it does add a plague priest to the garrison. Quite nice, but again, it would be all of my money. I would be in debt next turn, so let's not. Let's end the turn there, see what happens. Okay, then, they're coming out to me, us. I can work with this. Yeah, let's go for it. Nice little battle to finish the episode off. If we can beat this army, grab this settlement, then I would count that as a win. Right, this is just going to be a straight up, in a way, run at them. <laughs> I'm good at that strategy, so let's get the Skaven Slave stretched out nicely. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be sneaky and have these guys at the back. We good? Yeah, it's good enough. I'm gonna say, do we have the numbers? It's like, yeah, but with the quality of troops, I don't think that matters. Our best hope is to literally just overrun them. Clever, ignoring the slaves. It's just, what are we gonna do? Um, charge them. Okay. Alright though, they've just charged us. Oh, I love it. 
That, that's brilliant. Just, we'll just charge in. Yeah, right then. All of you guys, fire. You guys get in. You can help out. Okay, so that's actually our movement stop. So that's you in there. Actually, you guys go support them. You there. Get you with that. You with that. Don't see any cavalry on that side, so you can go there. Um, yeah, you're going into there. Um, Oh, we've pretty much smashed that center. That's what we do is use our sheer numbers to just overwhelm them. Like so, get behind them. Right, they've broke it. Go for them. You're getting into the back of them. Good job. They're picking them off. To anyone who's not fighting, I don't think everyone's involved, which is good. Yeah, you know what you're doing. You turn around. We do seem to be breaking them. Oh, a bit of magic being dropped on us there. Yep, they're being broken. We are being through them. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Let's just surround them and literally bury them under the bodies. There is no retreat. There is only victory. Or death. But to be fair, for a lot of these games, it's practically the same thing. That's good, they've got caught in. Right, I want you to go over there. How are you guys doing? You are breaking this one group of witch elves quite nicely and decisively. Reinforcements are coming. Oh, this whole flank's just given up. No, chase them, chase them down. There we go, guys. That's slowly breaking through them. I'll keep two units on them just to make sure they do actually break. Get in there. You guys. Oh, she's broken. What's left? I think it's mostly dark shards. Yeah. 
This is what I'm talking about. Get her down. First, the moment we put make contact with them, they'll just break. I suspect at this point. Yeah, they're being taken out. So they, we'll have to turn around soon. There we go, just as I said it. There we go. Get this one break and then they'll fuck. Boom, there we go. Victory is ours. Not bad for an army of mostly just clan rats and slaves. So it cost you dearly of slaves. It's. Yeah, to be fair, yeah, we lost nearly half our number. Which means over half our number survived. Wow, 99, a 92 on our own, 172. Yeah, they got a lot of kills. But, like I said, you got to remember the front wave was slaves, and look, a lot of them survived. <laughs> when you look at the actual damage on the left, it's most of it was taken by the slaves. Red, crown rats aren't too bad. Um, we so replenish. There is just a black arc just going about. <laughs> Don't know if we should be concerned about that. Or... Yes, they are taking damage and losses. And it looks like they are just going on a warpath. And it might even be they just leave afterwards. It's just, they're just getting some quick, easy... What? We're being ambushed, apparently. Oh, and this must be... Yeah, so we haven't got the set in there. We've just battered them badly. But we're now being attacked by Beastman and an ambush. Oh, dear. Um, but you know what, guys? That seems like a good place to end this episode here. Right on the edge of another cliffhanger. Big battle we're going to play. Um, deal with this herd once and for all. If I remember, we had killed most of them. So unless he's got reinforcements, there shouldn't be much left. Yeah, so we have to see how that goes. But anyway, we'll wrap it up there. Thank you very much for joining me, and I hope to see you for the next one. Till then, guys, take care.